We're here at Putna Monastery, and what's important about it, it is the first one of the Moldavian painted monasteries created by what is called Stephen the Great, later on Saint Stephen. Stephen was the greatest of all the Romanian leaders. From the 15th century, unfortunately it is not painted on the outside because it burned down at one time and they never repainted it and even on the inside you are allowed to take pictures on the inside because the frescoes are brand new. They removed what was left of the old frescoes and took it somewhere to a museum or so they say one never knows about these things. Let me see what else is interesting. According to historical interpretation the Cossacks burnt down the outside of the church to melt all the gold on the inside. Putna Monastery also houses the tomb of Prince Stephen, or Stephen the Great, the one above praise, according to the scholars. And it's a place of devotion for thousands of pilgrims from Romania. That is the only picture of Stephen the Great, or Saint, Saint Stephen, Saint Stephen and all representations of him, everything that has been painted since then, has that exact likeness. Even though everything in here is new, the iconostasis and everything was done in the same fashion as the old. You can see the exterior walls are just plain white. They were never painted again after the Cossacks came along and looted the church. Since you can video inside this monastery, you can see why they originally were painted to teach the people about the different saints, the Bible. Great tower.